short, stocky, short hair. Yes. Yeah, we're the poorest. <laughs> What is your score prediction for today? Um, I think we're gonna win uh, 200, no. I think we're gonna lose 200 to zero. What happened to the win? <laughs> um, I decided against it because something along the lines of good old Mizzou football. Fair um, enough. I'm also hoping that I can jinx it, but I guess the jinx is kind of, if you predict a jinx, is the jinx canceled? I don't know. I don't know if it, if it recorded very well, but Luther Burden just returned a punt on the very first punt of the game for a touchdown, so we're doing good. But my score prediction for this game was 35-21, so we'll see how that goes.
Be on the little pedal bike. Also, the game is now 17 to 3 with a little under three and a half minutes left. Uh, things are looking in our favor. Let's give these educators a big. We'd like to recognize all Woo. teachers and Almost time for halftime. We got 13 seconds and counting. You guys, Cooper's looking so attractive right now. Successful halftime completion. Excuse me for my burp. But we just now getting back and there's Brady and Tyler. And we are now up 24 to 3 after a Brady Cook short touchdown pass to Nathaniel Peak. Now we are on defense. They going to do something? Oh, nice catch. Mevis just missed a field goal. I am distraught right now. Brady Cook just got walloped and fumbled into the end zone, and they picked it up for the score, and they're going for the kick now. I'm still shook over um, Harrison Mevis missing that 52-yarder, so he's not perfect anymore, but let's see how this guy goes. And he just barely made it, and it's now 24-10. After a uh, Love It touchdown, we are now up 31-10, to 10, and half the student section is gone. Um, Mevis makes the kick. Score is now 34-17. Two, one, game over. We win 34-17. So, so close to my projection. As I was saying, we won 34-17. My original projection or prediction was 35-21. So I was close. And everyone's literally gone already.